So before I get into clarity mapping, which is the chapter I'm getting into and I am here, um, in the comment section below, I will, I mean, the description below, I will have a link to the book I'm talking about. I'm going through I am here as a means to learn her voice of the book because I'm ghostwriting a book for a client. But in the interim, this book is actually starting to help me. So as I read her words that she was feeling overwhelmed, she was feeling stuck, and at 11, her husband had to get her out of bed. That's me. I have actually been having a really hard time getting out of bed lately. And I told my other half, I was like, listen, this isn't like me. He knows it's not like me. He's known me for years since I was like, um, probably like, um, a late teenager, early adult. He's known me a long time and I've never been one that can't get out of bed. And, um, that person lately, I just, I, it's like, I don't want to sleep, but, um, I don't really want to sleep, but I don't really want to get out of bed. So I'm really struggling. I'm feeling like... We had all these plans of what we wanted to do and now we don't we don't want to do those things so the plan was is we we're going to buy land we were going to homestead we we're going to clear the land we we're going to get all these things and like we did most of the process and then it was like this doesn't feel right anymore the neighbors in the neighborhood had changed different things had changed we had changed and so that wasn't our our step anymore we're like yeah you know what maybe we don't want to do that um at least right now you know our kids are starting to get older and our youngest will be an adult in a couple of years so we're like you know what? We kind of want to get a motorhome um, because our middle is almost 18 and he'll be moving out probably in six months to a year, which will give us about a year or so with our other boy. And we would like to get in a motorhome and get a nice size motorhome and maybe travel a little bit with our dogs, right? But that's not what we wanted five years ago or, or four years ago, right? So because our goals have changed, but we never really sat in... in envisioned them and manifested them and thought about them we just kind of got let life take us by we started raising the kids the kids got into boxing the kids got the full-time job part-time jobs and all these things and we just let life take us away and we woke up one day and and uh, I don't know how he feels but I know I woke up one day and was like what am I doing I don't even know what I want anymore what do I want who am I who am I going to be when my kids are grown who am I on this side of parenthood right I've been a mom for half my life more than half my life right my oldest would be 22 I'm 42. So half my life, or a little under half my life, I guess, math. Um, I've been a mom, but now I'm going to be a different kind of mom to adult kids. So who am I? What is my other half and I going to do with that time, right? And I think I'm scared. I'm grieving the loss of a season in life before it's even gone. I still have a kid that's got two more years before he's 18. Um, and so I think I'm, my anxiety is causing me to get a little ahead of myself. So I'm excited to dive into this clarity mapping and I just want to record this little short video, well, almost three minute long video before I dive into the clarity mapping, just to kind of get, share how I'm thinking before I do it. And then I'll share how I'm thinking after I get into the clarity mapping, mapping with the I am here book. Thanks for listening. I hope you subscribe and travel along this journey from I don't want to get out of bed to I found my joy again. Love y'all. Hey everyone. Thank you so much for watching my video. This is just a quick pause to show you the sponsor of my videos as of lately. It's Naked Nutrition. I am an affiliate with them. I'm going to show you what I've been taking daily to help get things running smoothly in my life while I transition into new diet and lifestyles to help maintain nutrients with food. Since I don't need enough fiber in my diet, I decided to go with Organic Naked Fiber. This is from Naked Nutrition. I'll have the link in the description. Basically, you open it up. You take one scoop, one full scoop, and eight ounces of water. You put it right in here. You put the mason jar on top. You cover the mason jar, or you can do whatever, your, whatever mixer thing. You shake it up. And I will say the first time I drank it, it didn't taste so pleasant, but it goes down really quick. You just chug it. And I'll finish it in a second. So we do the naked fiber. I do that about three times a day, usually twice, but sometimes a third. And we also like the naked way in this household so that we can put this into our recipes if we want some extra protein. If I'm, again, not meeting my nutrition needs with my food, because sometimes times are tough right now, this 
And this can help us get through on those days when maybe we're not eating the right foods that we should be eating. And they're a little heavier price tag, but they're worth it because they're as close to natural as I can find in a supplement. So thank you so much for uh, learning more about today's sponsor, and I'll let you get back to the video. Have a beautiful day. And links in bio if you would like to try the fiber to keep things smoothly like me.